Hey there everybody, how's it going today? Ian back here with you with Stembo's Media Outlet. Hey, so this is a very light box. Um, I've actually already opened this. I just got it today. Uh, this is the Fall Nick box, which was the, um, kind of the, uh, the, ho uh, uh, the ho uh, Halloween kind of scary type of box. Um, excuse me, um, this, I got this tracking number on October 28th and I just got it today, just like December, December 9th. It went literally all over the place. I couldn't believe it. I finally saw the FedEx truck outside my house today, and I'm like, it, that can't possibly be, be my Nick box, but there it was. So, anyway, um, I did already open this, but some of the stuff I didn't open inside, so I'm just going to give you guys a quick look at what is in here. Some of the stuff I set over here. Um, the first thing I got is this uh, really cool Reptar bowl. It came in like a Reptar cereal box came with this spoon with a Reptar topper on it. So that's cool. Of course I grew up with the Rugrats, so that's pretty neat. Always find good, good to have another bowl. Uh, the other thing I got is their vinyl figure, um, Trick or Treat Heifer. Love me some Rocco's Modern Life. One of my all-time favorite Nicktoons. I, that, that show was ahead of its time. I really think so. I think like all, all the humor on there was very like grown up for for someone like who was like n nine or ten years old, like I was watching that show, but um, I I always loved Rocco. So this is, uh, this is the really cool vinyl figure here. Culturefly always does a great job on their vinyl figures. So um, I got some other cool stuff in this box. I'll just show you real quick. Um, there is a candle. I took the candle out of here, though. It's upstairs now. Darn it, I forgot I took it out. Um, there's a cool candle. It's just a little wax candle that says, Are You Afraid of the Dark on it? But it's pretty cool. Um, I got this uh, really cool. It's like a... It's a... It's a me oh, yes, sorry, I can't talk today. It's a messenger bag. A Ah Real Monsters messenger bag. Which is really cool. You got... Ickus in there with some cool pockets and everything, so that that's nice to have. Just want to carry stuff around in. Um, oh no, I got the candle right here. I I thought I put it upstairs. So there's the candle, approved by the Midnight Society. And then it's just a norm. It doesn't even have a smell to it. It's just a wax candle. So that's cool. Um, let's see what else did I get. Um, I got this. It is a uh, a Sugar Frosted Frights Shadow Box art. That's also from from Rocco. So that's just that's got a uh, Sugar Frosted Frights cereal, which is um, from uh, Filbert from Rocco. And you can and you can hang that up too. It's got a little hook on the back. And the last thing I got is my really awesome shirt, uh, which is an, it's a purple shirt, long sleeve. I def, and I have a lot more long sleeve shirts too. So this is a Are You Afraid of the Dark Midnight Society shirt. I'll show that off in the front there. I'll show that off in the back. Very cool. I do love this shirt. I have another like short sleeve shirt too that I really enjoy wearing. Because Are, Are You Afraid of the Dark was super scary to me when I was growing up. That like the, Even the opening credits, I think, are still scary to that show. So, um, and there is also... I don't know where to put it now, but there is an enamel pin set. I think I put those up in, in my desk. There is an enamel pin set of Icus Crumb and Oblina. Which is the only thing I'm missing out of this box, so... So we got the awesome, oh, it's uh, going in the dark long, long sleeve shirt, the Reptar cereal bowl, the shadow box art, the enamel pin set, which is upstairs, the Halloween heifer vinyl figure, the glow in the dark candle, and the, me the messenger bag. So overall, I think that this was a good box. So cool stuff. I, I love the shirt. I love heifer. Uh, the messenger bag will think will do me good in the future. Uh, the, the candle's okay. It's always good to have another bowl. The art thing is probably my least favorite, and I always love some pins, so. Okay, uh, that's my extremely light fall Nick Pox. 
Uh, let me know down in the comments what you guys thought about this box. Uh, what was your, your favorite item? Mine was definitely the shirt, but if, if you have another favorite, let me know. Uh, like and, and sub subscribe to my page, Stumbo's Media Outlet, and ring the bell for notifications so you guys know when I post new videos. So I'm going to be trying to do that a lot more. I realize, I, I apologize, it's been a couple weeks since I posted. I've had a lot going on, so um, I'm going to be trying to post a lot more recently. So, okay, that, that, that's all I got for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.